Hi loves, today I'm going to do a kind of a collective haul, uh, just a few things I bought within like the last month or two months. I know eBay will probably date back to the last maybe two or one and a half months. So I'm going to start with Rainbow and I have five purchases from Rainbow and I don't, this is not really gearing me up for spring, not, not so much but somewhat. Um, I'm trying to get this together. Bear with me. Okay. So, and I'm going to try on the pieces that I can try on. And, uh, yeah. So, if I can try them on, of course, if they're clothing items, I'll try them on. Now, the first thing I have here is this olive dress. And I was completely infatuated with it. It was $12.99. However, I bought it in a 3X. And it just comes down, I think, about to the knee or a little bit past it. And if you watched my Sexy Plus clothing boutique review, you will see that I wore this dress. And the back is a low scoop neck. So as you can see right here is the front. And this is the back. And it goes low. Um, I bought everything in the 3X because when I used to shop at Rainbow very often, um, I realized it was Junior Plus, so I had to always size up. And now when I actually sized up it was too big um, right here in the breast area it's too wide and I guess I'll have to just alter it I don't really like returning things other than that it fits really nicely it is ribbed okay so that was $12.99 the next thing I have is this blazer which fits really good so I'm glad I got a 3x it's $20.97 and it, I think it was from the New Arrivals, and it's just this dusty rose blazer, and this is really for the, this is good for the spring. It has this ruching sleeve, and it's like a three-quarter sleeve, and it does, it doesn't have pockets, but it has, you know, the little illusion right here, the faux pockets, the imaginary pockets, <laughs> but it's really cute, and it is a um, crop blazer, so it's not like it'll cover your butt or anything like that. Um, that was $20.97 and I got it in a 3X. The next thing I have here, I already wore these. If you follow me on Instagram, I wore an all black outfit when I went out to eat. And so I did wash them so they probably look a little dingy. Leggings don't last that long unless you have that good pair of black leggings. Now these, however, after I washed it, it, it doesn't look too bad. It's distressed at the knee. Um, I feel like... I could have got these in a 2X because they were really loose and when I want when I wear leggings I want them to be really tight but not suffocating but you know what I mean um so yeah I got these in a 3X and they were $12.99 I did wash them so and this is before I tried them on again so when I tried them on for you guys hopefully they did shrink into place and I did wash that dress too to see if that would shrink so we'll see um and the Fourth thing I got was this clutch. Originally $12.99. If you watch my Sexy Plus review and styling, you will see that I styled this dress. I mean, what? I styled this clutch with um, a black dress and a fur vest. And I paid $6.50. It was 50% off. And it's really cute. Um, it's really structured. And that's what I like about it. Because I have another clutch I'm going to show you that's not structured at all. So it's very big. And I like big clutches. So... Yeah, I really do like this, and it's like a uh, pebble, black and gold. And the fifth thing I got was these boots, and they're faux suede, and they are wide calf. Um, I cut this part right here to make it a little more loose because I could zip it up, but I felt really like constrained in it, so I did cut it. And I don't, it don't really make, it doesn't really make a difference for me. It's really still comfortable and they look, it looks like it was made that way. So yeah, if you have a problem with wide calf boots and you have this elastic part and you want to um, make them fit a little bit more comfortable, just cut a, a V in it. You understand? So it'll look like it's a part of design. But that's just my little tip. So that's everything I got from Rainbow. The next thing is this right here. Or these right here. <laughs> um, I really, when I saw them on Wet Seal, these is from what's, or what, 
These are from Wet Seal. <laughs> when I saw them, I was like, they look a little like, um, I didn't think they would be too cute because they, they weren't nice on the model. But luckily, my calves are bigger than the models, and they fit really snug and really pretty. Um, but the other, those rainbow boots, I don't think I would be comfortable if I wore jeans with them. I would probably just wear it with dresses um, and things of that nature and skirts. But these are really comfortable, and I can put, I can fit like pants, legs in here comfortably. And so yeah, I really like the color. I thought it stood out a lot. Again, faux suede, and the back is like this. I don't know what material that is, but it's really stretchy. So yeah, these were originally $44.89. I got them on sale for $17.96. So that was a good steal from Wet Seal, and I really like it. Um, the next thing I'll do, I'm so disappointed with this order. But first of all, Rose Gal, if you guys haven't watched from me before, you know I did a review on Rose Gal. Well, you wouldn't know if you haven't watched me, but if you <laughs> if you have been watching me, I've done a review on Rose Gal. I said nothing but good things because my first order was awesome. However, this order, I'm very disappoint disappointed in, but again, you get what you pay for sometimes. Um, I ordered this like back in January. January 8th, I made this order. I just got this yesterday. Today is March the 5th. I got this on March 4th. So this order took practically two months to get to me. Um, and then I'm like, okay, it is coming from China. It was the holidays. It, They had the Chinese festival. <sighs> I was just so disappointed. However, it's finally here. I probably won't get... Alright, we're just going to go ahead and get into it. <laughs> this shirt or well it's supposed to be a dress but I ordered it in a 2x so I know it was going to be a shirt it's just one of those scoop bottoms um if you watch me before and the other rose gal you know I got a red one like this the red one however I got in a 3x and it does fit as a dress but this one I got in a 2x and it doesn't it fits like a shirt I, it's really short it covers my butt but on the sides where it does go up it's um too high I would not wear it as a dress but it is a great material and I will wear it as a shirt um, the next thing I got was this um, bodycon sleeveless black dress with the split up the front it was $13.45 um, very low cleavage very see-through as you can see um, the material is awful it's like a t-shirt it's t-shirt material it's basically it feels like a really thin cotton or something and the split is not well made it's just like uh, um, I mean I don't I, it just wasn't the material I thought it should be if you're making a, a bodycon dress you should make a um, with the split and all of that it should be a thicker like with a little bit of spandex in it it does it doesn't stretch too much I'm just not pleased with it I ordered it in the 3x I'm going to wear it because I paid money for it, but yeah, not pleased. I'm sorry if this haul is going to be long, but I have a lot of things to show you guys. This next thing was supposed to be a t-shirt dress. I ordered it in a 2, no, I ordered it in a 3X because I really wanted it to be a t-shirt dress. And I wanted to wear some black converses with it. Um, however, it's too short and too tight so I'll just have to wear it as a regular shirt which I don't mind I paid twelve dollars and fifty eight cents for this I like the striping right here I thought it would be really cute with some black converses and as a t-shirt dress but no it doesn't fit like that um it looks like I got makeup on it but it's a very nice like if it is cotton it's a very nice cotton I do like the material of this and yeah that's the rose gal order completely unsatisfied but um let's get into my weight loss products I only have three of them I had to re-up on some stuff so I have my resolution drops if you don't know I'm a distributor with TLC so um, and that's how I've been losing weight so I have I ordered some more resolution drops I ordered some more of the detox coffee these are $79.95 they've been on sale for a really long time that might just be the new permanent price this is a muffs or 20 packs of coffees for uh, $44.95 great price I love the flavor I don't put any sugar or anything like that just um, creamer and that's it I don't need sugar um, this next thing is my tea 
and four packs for my supply for again $44.95 and it's the ISO T all of these are from the ISO line so yeah if you read my weight loss story on my website you guys know I've been using mostly the T in the resolution but um, this month I'm going to do a triple threat and use the tea, coffee, and resolution. Um, so that's my weight loss products. The next thing I got in the mail finally was my t-shirt from my personal line that I am launching on March 15th. So this is my t-shirt. Well, one I have 20 designs. This is 1 out of 20. And it's just a basic t-shirt. And these will be around $25, $30 when I put them up for sale. And that's just my first shirt from my line. I made a whole video on it. That's why I'm not really getting into it. And yeah. Um, I'll talk about ColourPop next. Uh, so as soon as they came out with they satins, I was on it. But I didn't get many. I just got five, I believe. No, I got three satins. And I got uh, the Karushe. I don't know how to say her name. But the K-pop collection <laughs> that's going on. And I got a, a, a Ray Ray. I love, it's my Ray Ray. I love her. So I had to get her color. Now you get a message from Karuche. Karuchi, I don't know how to say her name. She's a very pretty young woman. I think she's a model, I'm not sure. So it says, for the beautiful, independent, free-spirited girl, let your light shine bright. I thought that was really cute. I always love the notes that ColourPop puts in their orders. And this one is from ColourPop. And it says, Darius Daquana. Um, you the best XL color pop so and it gives you some other tips on how to do your satins I don't want to make this too too long so I'm just going to try to rush through it I don't want to rush either but you guys know what I mean alright so this one is a K and it's a, like a nice little brown I think it will be a pretty nude for my skin tone and for a lot of women of color and the next one I have is, I think, Stingray. Yeah. Of course, I told you guys I was going to get that. Now, hold on. Let me show you the difference. Okay, so this is Stingray, which is really pretty. A sexy mauve color. But when you look at this one, it has the uh, rose gold band right here. And, you know, the other ones just have silver. However, I love ColourPop. Uh, I probably wear it every day except for today of course. <laughs> I'm wearing actually from Bite Cosmetics the Pepper Lipstick. The ones that are edible and has an amazing smell. I don't think Sephora released them yet but I got them in a Vox box. And this one is the new uh, satin and it's just the normal. I actually, this is Magic Wand. Yeah, I wore this one when I did this wig review. And it's really pretty. I love the way it feels on my lips. I honestly forgot that I even had it on my lips at one point. And it lasted for a pretty long time. Um, and it did transfer. It's not a matte. So, yeah. And this one is Mess Around. And you probably can't see these colors. I didn't think I should swatch them because it's only going to be... I only, I only got three of them. Three of the satins. Um... And this one is Prim, which I was really excited about. Because when Vicky Logan had put it on, it looked really nice on her. So, yeah. Um, I got some Mary Kay samples. I don't think I should include them, but I will. Um, I thought they would take up a lot of time. That's all. Now, I ordered this, I don't know how long back, but it was an issue with, like, the shipping. Um... Kimberly, Miss Kimberly, I ordered from her and she she said she got the address wrong. With I was not complaining. I was just like, I support small businesses. So I was like, girl, you know, just go ahead and get it right. And she gave me like, since she made that mistake, she gave me like extra samples and she gave me a $20 certificate. So I thought that was really nice of her. Um, she sent, I only ordered a few samples and I ordered a uh, eyeshadow. And then she sent extra things. This is one of the extras. You guys probably can't see it. But it's like this blue crayon um, eyeshadow. And then the next thing she sent was a brow liner. However, my brows are not this light. So I won't be able to use that. Um, but I might get away with doing some shadows or something. And the little samples come like this with a little brush in it. And this is a gloss. It's rich spice. 
Um, I'm trying to get into lip glosses and stuff like that. So I'll see how that goes. And uh, this one is a lipstick and it's sizzling red. I can't wait to try that out. I hope it's matte, but we'll see. This one is a lipstick as well, and it's Tuscan Rose. Reminds me of Pepper that I have on my lips right now, so I probably will really like that. This next one is a lip gloss, and it's Beach Bronze. Um, and this last one is a lipstick, and it's Raisinberry. Alright, so I think it'll be about one or two applications in that small package. And then she sent like some cleansers for the face, some moisturizer, and uh, I think this is a foundation primer. So the light is really drowning it out. So yeah, just looks like that. Probably one application. And what I actually ordered full size was this uh, Amber Blaze eyeshadow and I ordered it for a transition color I like I don't really like the way they package their eyeshadows it looks really like inexpensive but I mean it's fine I think it was about eight dollars I paid eight dollars for it oh my gosh I just dropped it okay so I don't like the packaging if it's gonna fall out that easily maybe it has like a palette that it goes in but that's the what it looks like and yeah it has a really you can't see because of the light but it has a really nice pigment I really like the eyeshadow I'm gonna order some more now let's get into eBay this is my baby eBay is my baby for life I will always shop on eBay as long as they're around so let's go all the way to the bottom so I ordered four LA Girl Pro um, concealers and this is these were $9.88 I ordered three warm honey and one orange color corrector that I finally got my hands on so I'm super excited about that I ordered this hair wig for $36.95 super excited about that and I ordered this faux fur clutch which is a dusty pink and it was eight dollars and eighteen cents it did come from China but it was really fast um, the inside is black I believe and it has a rose gold zipper oh the inside is brown and it has a rose gold zipper pink and brown look really pretty together so yeah the next thing I ordered was this New York Yankees um, Velcro bag, and I paid $16.95, and of course it's pink because I love pink. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to get this stuff out the way. Okay, so I ordered a bodysuit, and it was $16.99. I got it in a 2X because it was coming from USA. If it's not from USA, I gotta get a 3X or 4X because that's mean it that means it's from China. And it's just a lace up. So you know that good old cleavage area. This is really on trend for what's happening now in the fashion world. Um this next thing is this uh oh my gosh I've been looking for a jean jacket forever and this is the jean jacket I love the faux leather sleeves, well sleeve detail. I love the wash of the denim. The fit is beautiful. So yeah, super excited about this. Um, I ordered this blazer for my new thrifty lookbook that I have coming up that's going to be a collaboration with a surprise guest um, who's just now starting out. I'm super happy to work with him. Um, so this is the red baseball jersey, and I got it in a men's extra large, and I paid five dollars for it. So yes, and that jean jacket was sorry I didn't give you the price. The jean jacket was ten dollars. Like, where do you find a jean jacket like this for ten dollars? Exactly, nowhere. Like I said, this was five dollars. Um, these next items you're probably gonna be like, girl, why? <laughs> Look at these. 
it came with a pack of two and I paid ten uh, $10.99. Now I didn't wear buy these to wear like on a daily basis like some granny panties. These are actually some briefs that I wanted to put under this mesh red dress that I'm going to receive from Posh Teak. I can't wait and I also am going to put a red bra. So I got a bra from there for about $5, $6, $5.94. And it's going to go with them briefs and it's going to go under a mesh dress. So <laughs> that's why those briefs are so huge. I got hair oil. Two. And each one was $1.40. I got the shea butter oil and the jojoba oil. Um, I love this one, the jojoba. It smells really good and has made my hair feel wonderful. I bought a phone case for $6.95. So just... A pink phone case with a black rubber thing they come apart for extra protection so funny when this came in the mail the same day my phone fell in the toilet and ceased to work so I'm currently waiting on a new phone for my new case the old one is dead and gone that toilet water really tore it up the last two things I have sorry this video was so long are two pairs of sneakers so I bought a pair of Adidas for $60. Um, just something simple. Something that I thought would be cute for the spring when I wanted to dress casual. Um, so yeah. Okay, so my camera cut off and I don't know where. Like I was saying, I got these from um, eBay for $60. And these are the SL Loops. I thought they would be great for walking. And they look really comfortable. And they look really trendy with this design right here. And lastly, I got some Roshi runs, if that's how you say them. And I got them for $39.99. Both of these I got in a 7Y, which is grade school sizes for boys. And this is the Roshi, red, black, and white. On the inside is yellow. I thought this was really cute. And $39.99, you can't really... I think it's a very nice price. So, yeah, my next shoe that I want is the Harachis. And I also have my eye on another pair of Adidas that I plan to get really soon. So that's the end of my haul and I decided to just insert clips of me trying on the items while I'm talking because this video is over 20 minutes and I do apologize for how long it is. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for joining. I hope you join me next time and if you like this video go ahead and thumbs it up and if you like my channel go ahead and subscribe. <laughs> Thank you.